Hello Amiibros, this is Jason of Game and & Shocks, and welcome back to my Let's Play on Bioshock for the PlayStation 3. So, last time we continued around the, in the medical pavilion where we found the telekinesis plasmid. Uh, we, we threw stuff around, and uh, we found Dr. Steinman, but we died against him. So now we're going to go back and, uh, and finally hit, lay him to rest. So now we're going to continue on as we... Go after Dr. Steinman and maybe finish up around, um, around the medical pavilion. So now, let's start. So here's my, uh, here's my bot, and, uh, let's head off. So first off, before we begin, you, um, you'll notice that I have, um, a lot more health and, and, um, I, um, first aid kits and Eve with me. That's because I, I started a new file and I dropped the game's difficulty down to easy. Now, not out of, like, because, oh, I think the game's too hard. Um, because I, th I just feel like it'll just be, like, a better time overall. And, don't get me wrong, like, I'll, I'll probably finish the game on normal, like, like, off, like, off camera. But, um, you know, maybe it'll probably, probably just be, like, a much better time overall. Because, like, I can shoot a hole in the, in this corpse's brain. And my voice cracked. How very disappointing of me. Alright, so let's see. And also, um, off camera when I was trying to, when I was getting back here, I found, um, remember the wrench do jockey, um, tonic that I, that I, um, that I didn't know how to get to? Once we defeat Dr. Steinman, we're gonna go and get it. Cause now I know, how, now I know how to get it, and, um, there was also another, um, pa another pack that I managed to get, that, um, we'll get on the way back as well. Okay, so now let's fight him again, even though I'm not easy, so this shouldn't be like, too, too big of an issue. So we just electrocute him and shoot him in the head, and he's already at half health, and then uh, we just shoot him again. Oh, never mind, let's just uh, take this. Oh, he, he missed. Take this, take my, take my firepower to the death. Oh, he's not dead. Die! <laughs> And there we go. I maybe I should have went back to normal. I might regret that later down the road, but uh, we'll see. And there's a trophy: defeated Dr. Steinman. Not what she wanted. Oh, it's an audio log. Alright, so now we gotta get the, open the emergency access. So that was a lot quicker than I was expecting. I thought it was gonna be uh, something else, cause like there's a there's a health station down here. Because the thing is, like, between each difficulty, like, it affects the trophies. So, um, I don't know. I feel like, it, yeah, anyways, let's, let's just leave. Um, and now, and now the music's just gotten a lot more shrill. And just like, uh-oh, what's going on now? Alright, so, I remember going through there. Let's go, let's go back to the, oh, we got, we got these guys. Hello, hi, how, how are all of you? Good to see you here in this uh, magical little uh, world we call the Puddle. The Puddle of Rapture. It's a very nice place, um, but uh, you're all dead. And it's good that you're all dead. Uh, let, let's get out of here. Uh, is that is that a hole in the brain? Oh, oh yeah, it's still there. What happens if I... Wow, even a, f a, f <laughs> a point-blank shotgun blast does not take off the head of a, a corpse. I mean, this ain't no, uh, Soldier of Fortune or Doom, where, you know, you can just break off body parts like that. Like, it's, this isn't that game. Oh, do I have to, do I have to get out of here? Do I have to get through, out of this tunnel? Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a big daddy. Oh, hi, uh, hello. Oh, it's a bouncer, but it's still big daddy. What happened here? It's a little sister. So uh, now what? Oh, is this is this where we're gonna find the li get the little sisters?
little ones. It's okay, lad. I'm not a child. Not anymore, are they? Dr. Tenenbaum's thought of that. Victor, do not hurt them. Hurt them Uh, it's our first encounter with the little sister. And now we've got the tonic for it, so... We gotta slowly crawl up to her. So what's this? Choose whether to rescue the little sister or harvest her. If you harvest her, you get maximum atom to spend on, on plasmids, but she will not survive the process. If you ra rescue her, you get less atom, but Tenenbaum will, has promised to make it worth your while. So, like, what happens if I don't? If I, like, harvest her? Would she, like, just shoot me right then and there? I've never done it on harvest, so... Uh, so I'll, I guess I'll just continue then and do rescue. No! 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 Thank you. Thank you. Sus, but that's something that just really makes this game uh, distinct. Like getting the little sisters is one of the hot. Is um. Uh, it's one of, like harvesting or rescuing the scissor the sis little sisters probably one of the hardest um. One of the hardest decisions like ever like. It's like would do you like kill them and get a lot of atom or not kill them but get less uh, atom? It's a very uh. Very tough decision, and it's just like a simple like to this or that. Uh, so so here's a gatherer's garden where you can purchase some gene upgrades. So we got enrage, we got armored shell, Eve link, um, health upgrade, and an Eve upgrade. Um, and I can actually purchase uh, any of these. I can do these ones, but um, let's do. Hmm. And you could also preview them. Oh, well, I think actually I think Enrage is the only um, actual plasmid. So let, let's just see what it does. Enrage your enemies. Laugh as your enemies fight each other. T evolve today. <laughs> Piss your enemy off. <laughs> um, let's, let's, I like this uh, this music. That's armor shell. So are these like passive abilities, like reduces all physical damage. Enrage's target. Um, I'll go with the Eve one for now. You can now carry more Eve in your body, allowing you to use more plasmids before you having to reload with an Eve hypo. Okay, so, but now I know. But now you kind of know how these works. And I think how, I think the more the more we go through the game, um, the more um, stuff will be available at Gatherer's Garden. So let's see. Can I not go back to the? Um, can I, can I not go back and get, like, the upgrades I want? Or can I? I hear a big daddy. Um, so... Can I go through here? So, okay, I can't. That way, that's where I came from. Wrong way. Oops! Let's see, so, uh... So, uh, how you guys doing? Sorry I have Sorry I didn't, um, upload a video yesterday. Uh, the, oh, I can't go that way. I'm stuck. Oh, well. So we, we have to go this way. I would, I, if I, if I could show you, I, w I would, um, actually, I think I'll go, um, um, actually, right now, I'll go to my other file, and I'll show you where, how to get wrench jockey, give me, hold on, okay, so I found out, coming back to this point, um, uh, remember when, um, at this furnace, when the, um, when the camera went off, and I had to fight the security, so if you actually put this put this cook in the furnace, like you know, he'll he'll be cremated. 
But I found out that um, that if you if you bring it back out, um, I did it again. If you let it in, if you let the corpse incinerate, it will bring out um, you know a pile of ash. But it'll also bring out this, the hacker's delight. With hacker's delight, your body converts the altered current uh, current from a hacked machine into a powerful healing agent. Hack and heal. Uh, you picked up your first physical tonic. Physical tonics make you stronger and or more powerful. They are equipped separately from plasmids and other types of tonics. So I can just uh, hmm, pick a slot, any slot. Uh, this one. All right, now I'm gonna go get the wrench jockey. Okay, now there's wrench jockey. So I found out what you have to do is you have to go this way um, to this like surgical room over here. And you see that grate right there? Shoot it. Just shoot it off, and then duck underneath, and then boom! You now have Wrench Jockey. <laughs> wrench Jockey bulks up your upper body, allowing you to wield club-like weapons with unprecedented skill and power. And this is a combat tonic. And, uh, you know, let's, let's, let's be that guy, and we'll put it in this slot. And there we go. I don't know how many Wrench... I'm not, that's probably the only Wrench Jockey. But that might not be the last time we get a combat, um, tonic at all. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, it's, so it has, like, those kind of secrets. Kind of like Doom 2016, or Doom Eternal's, um, secrets where, like, it shows you the secret, but then, like, the, like, how to get to it is close by, and then, like, your mind kind of fills in the rest. Alright, and now I will meet you back at the, where the little sister was. But that's not all. There was also this one that I guess I also missed as well. In plain sight. For some stupid reason. Why? Because I'm a moron. Uh, so Static Discharge. Ryan Industries introduces the latest in wartime deterrent genetics. Static Discharge makes you a walking Tesla coil. Zapping anything and everything foolish enough to, be, to strike you. Feel safe. Be safe with Static Discharge. And it's another combat tonic. So we've already got two uh, that I missed because uh, at times I am just stupid. And now back and now back to the regularly scheduled game. Okay, and here we are, back. So I noticed that the Gatherer's Garden, like once the, like these curtains went up, I noticed that th when they went up, I heard the sound of the um, the scare extractor from Monsters Inc. No joke, I am, like, I'm not kidding. It sounded like that, like, go back and listen and, and watch this over. It's the same sound effect. Like, I, I don't know why, but I noticed it. I, I don't know how, how to explain it. Uh, oh, we're back here again. Uh, oh, and uh, we got another one of these guys. Goodbye. So I guess uh, um, I could have just uh, came back and and showed you everything, but I didn't know that this would uh, be be the way it is. But uh, it is what it is. Um, but uh, so let's head off this way. As uh, I think we're done here. <laughs> Good. Alright, here we go. This is our fir our first big daddy of the game. There is another little sister ahead. To get Adam from her, you must deal with her big daddy first. Oh boy. Right, so, I guess, so, I guess... So, the best th way to deal with bi big daddies is um, armor-piercing bullets. Which, I oh god, did he see me? Please tell me he didn't see me. I've got a lot of ammo in my machine gun, but, uh... Let's use, let's use my armor piercing bullets and let's, let's take them down. Go. Yeah, see, like, they, they can take like a lot of hits in the, but, um, I, I mean, sure, I'm making them sound, seem like a piece of cake, but, uh, trust me, these guys are no joke. It's, a, it's just that I just have a lot of ammo on me. And then there he, there he is, the bouncer of Big Daddy, dead, and, uh, his leg shaking. And I got a hundred and fourteen dollars of it, and then let's see, the little sister. Um, I'll rescue this one. I might not rescue them all the time, but um, 
I think most of the time I'm gonna be do I'm gonna be doing it. You saved me. The thing is, what's with the little sisters and they're like constant frown face? That's really strange. Is is maybe it's the feeling of being exercised and uh and um and just you know that 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 way of being back to normality. Okay, so, uh, so we got a circus of value. It's, it's, uh, oh, I thought I hacked this one before, but I think I, I think I did, and I can still do it if I want. But uh, so let's do it. Uh, so let's, where is it? I need one that goes to the left. Uh, yeah, th this one. I need this one. Uh, and then okay, like you got it. You gotta keep thinking. Keep like keep on your toes as a. Uh, Stuff does get you. Let's see, what, I need, okay, I, I don't know why, but I'm not finding a lot of these ones for some reason. All right, get this, and then okay, and then do this one. The exit's all the way at the top, so get this one, and then uh, this one, and then uh, this one, and then this one, and then I gotta get <laughs> the twisty one. Oh, oh, no, not that. Oh, these are the same one. It doesn't matter. With this and this and this and, and there we go done it didn't matter either way but uh let's grab some uh, what, what do i need more of oh, i don't have any electric bucks so let's just grab a, a ton of those thank you circus of value <laughs> now let's, let's go so so we have to go this way yeah we have to go to that bat sphere right there uh, so we get there's a splice right there right now. You you my my boy are uh, dead. Now you are and uh, what's with the bombs? Why do these guys have so many like bombs on them? So yeah, um so let's just uh, let's head through here if I can head through here, can I? Oh, I still I still can't, I thought I could. Alright, I, this is the only place I think the the game told me to go through. Oh and this is my goal, so do I have to hit the lever again? It's up here. No? Oh wait, I, no wait, never mind, I do. Security alert deactivated. Thank you for your patience. There we go, open the emergency access. There we go, even though Atlas is uh, questioning my decision on saving the little sisters, but um, I don't, I don't care. Alright, so now we gotta go to Neptune's Bounty. So maybe I shouldn't have changed this to um, the medical pavilion, but uh... I think we'll look around here a bit and then we'll call it a day. But uh, it's been um... Pretty good, so maybe I, maybe I shouldn't have changed the, the difficulty to easy, I don't know. It's like the decisions of the Little Sisters. Should I have done that? I don't know. Uh, let's see. So, uh, so how are you guys doing? Hopefully, all of you. Oh wait, I think I did. Like, how are you guys doing earlier? Uh, um, so, um, I. Now I'm now I'm just stumped. Um, so I guess another thing that I wanted to talk about was the fact that um, I guess the reason as to why I didn't have an upload yesterday, assuming I didn't do that in the first place, um, I stubbed my toe really badly yesterday. And uh, I was just, it, I, I really badly. I won't go into detail, but like, it hurts so much that I just didn't want to record. Alright, so now we gotta go to Fontaine Fisheries with um with this lovely image. How many little sisters? There's three little sisters here. So let's uh let's walk around and look at that, a nice little circus of value. <laughs> How lovely. Um but I don't I don't need anything right now, so I'm not gonna buy anything. And then here's our first gene bank. So here uh, you, so here you can change like out change out um, those, all of your um your tonics and plasmas. So I got the plasmids, like you can, um, see. so we can like, change them. So like, um, so like, do I not want the electro bolt? I can switch it out with the incinerate. I'll keep electro bolt and I'll I'll take out telekinesis for incinerate. 
Because I'm probably going to be using Incinerate much more than, um, than Telekinesis. I know, it is, it's cool to use uh, tele Telekinesis, but, um, I don't see it as, like, it's all, it's kind of, I find it kind of a bit situational. I mean, everything's kind of situational, but, uh, everything has, like, multi-use, like, with fire, you could use it on oil, or just, just shoot it, or just shoot it at, at everything that you see. Um, it's your pick. So, see, do I have to go this way? Oh, yeah, I do. And then we go to, the, so, so Neptune's Bounty, everyone. What a... What a lovely place. Right, let's see. So is that a little sister or is that a splice? That's probably a splicer. Just sucking this guy's um, atom out of him. That's, all right, I don't need any uh, first aid kits. So what's over here? Oh, it's just a health bank, but... You know, why not? I'm going to be getting a ton of money anyway. And now there's, rose, there's rosebuds falling from the ceiling. What's that about? I don't know. Oh, oh god, there's a big daddy. Uh, you know what that means. Hmm, let's see. I forgot, our, our big daddy's um, weak to electric, to the electric bucks and shotguns, I don't remember. But uh, anyway, we gotta, we gotta shoot him now. Um, let's see, okay, actually, the armor-piercing bullets are not, ow, are not doing much. Uh, seems to me that the, the machine gun is, like, really what's, uh, what's bringing this, this guy down. <laughs> this big guy. Little sisters cannot be harvested while the big daddy is alive. Makes sense, but now he's dead. Oh, it's a rosy, and it, and I got a, and a rivet gun, and a, uh, what's shooting at me? Is that a turret that's near me? Where is it? Or is that, a, or is that a splicer over there? Oh, it's behind me. Oh, it's a turret. Why is there a turret down here? But now, now it's, now it won't, is it? And now it's gone. <laughs> Goodbye. Forever. Uh, let's see. Oh, I, I need to harvest the big daddy it, itself. All right, now for the. Uh, okay, I'll show how uh, what happens when you harvest them. That's what happens. They they turn into like this this like small little like I guess sort of like uh, drug filled eel it looks like that's that's what it looks like oh and, oh look another uh, another tonic a medical expert with medical expert your first aid kits will go farther healing your sickness and injury at a rate that you're sh that you're sure to find astounding now astonishing don't don't use a first aid kit without your best friend medical expert uh, oh and I have an extra slot okay that's even better. Uh, so, and then there's a, oh, another turret right there. What what is that doing? This this is truly shocking. <laughs> no, uh, am I even hitting it? I don't think I am. So let's get the splicer up here because uh, oh, actually there's two of them, husband and wife. It looks like. Oh no, they're both. Uh, I, I guess it was just two friends just going out at each other. Uh, so, okay, there we go. Now we got a closer look. And now we don't. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> don't mind me. I'm just I'm just a casual guy in Rapture. Just shooting the windows and just, uh, just, just, you know, just la di da di da, just being, just being like everyone else in Rapture. It's just, it's amazing. So let's see. Um, so we got a bunch of ammo and, and just empty guns down here. Oh. Oh, this guy, see, these guys see me. Uh oh. Uh, and another thing, I'm not gonna be, I, I'm, you're probably not gonna see me be iron sight aiming that much. Because I don't find iron sight aiming that practical, because, like, you don't have... The circle's just way more, way, just way better. Sure, you can zoom in a bit. Oh, wait, let me change. Wait, hold on. Uh, yeah, sure, you can do this, but it doesn't really... Uh, and you can see kind of what's in front of you, but, like, you don't have the circle of where you're aiming. So I think, I just think it's better. And where's this guy? Oh! You think you can get away from me, you're like, you, nice try, smoke man! Alright, uh, let's, let's leave, as, um, I feel like we could be fighting these guys forever, and ever, and ever, and ever. Alright, so, let's see, let's, we need to go this way, yeah, there's a, uh, there's a gene bank right here, if we want to, like, put in anything, but I don't think we need anything. And then, um, okay, so the only thing we don't have is an engineering tonic. I thought we would at this, at this point, but... We'll probably get some, get one at some point, but... 
<laughs> oh, and there's an RPG turret. There's a lot of turrets here, I'm noticing. But, oh, and I'm out, I'm out of ammo. I, I wasted all my ar all my armor-piercing bullets. Oops! Alright, and then, uh, and then, uh, this guy, just casually walking around, because we, because, you know, he trusts the Gordon's Fisherman. No. Well, he probably does, but, um, he, he took, he probably just injected Adam into the fish. Uh, so that's not good. Oh, and is this a Nazi? How did the Nazi, how did the Nazi get down here in Rapture? How? I, I want to know. But now I will never know. Uh, so let's, oh, and then there's a, oh, and then there's a, some electric bucks. So is there electric bucks in here? No. You would think that, that a circus of value would have a valuable thing like electric bucks, but no, that's not the case. Uh, let's see, let's, let's go in here. Who can blame a lady who craves variety? Who's that? Hello? Alright, so here we are at Fontaine Fisheries, but, uh... And one day, let's... the gentleman stopped calling. So, uh, hello? Who is this? Hello? Who is this? Atlas written on my head. Says you're looking for an invite to the fisheries. Nuts, I say. But if in your heads up to the Warp Master's office and find old Peach on research camera, maybe I could manage an invite. What was that? My friend, you are fucked. Am I now? So that is uh, Peach Wilkins, uh, the very, very. Very, very distant cousin of uh, Princess Peach, as, as we all know. Uh, it's just that uh, pr uh, Peach is as, as so as as distance herself as much from Peach Wilkins over here as uh, again he's just like everyone else. Oh, and also this woman as well. Because uh, some some people are just crazy and they just won't stop at being crazy until either they're dead or they think they're dead. Oh no! This this person is taking a lot of punishment. Let's uh, let's change that. Let's just uh, let's make her stop all this like flippy dippy crap and just uh, make her stop where, wherever she went. Cause she's throwing hooks at me. I want to get to Peach Wilkins. So let me get to Peach Wilkins. Sure thing, Peach. I don't know why every time I keep thinking of Peach, even though Peach Wilkins is right in front of me, I keep thinking of Princess Peach. I think it's just, I think it's just because of, you know, Peach is just more more popular than Peach Wilkins. So yeah, uh, we gotta get a pe uh, almost a peach again, <laughs> a, a research camera so we can get a, uh, let pe so Peach Wilkins can let us in. But uh, where is that camera? That I do not know. But uh, I'm gonna kill the rest of the rest of the splicers that are down here, and then I think we'll call it we'll call it a day. Actually, that might be the last one, or probably not. There might be one more, but uh, is there one more? I don't think there is. But we get to we get uh they get to hear the nice uh, intercom announcements. It's like attention, Gordon's fisherman fish is a dollar now. Congratulations. All right, so let's so I think we'll call it a day right here. So let's see. we got proximity mines, and uh, there's gotta be like a weapon in here. Oh, there isn't. I don't know why I have proximity mines now. Can I use them? 
I can't, but I don't know what to do with them. But uh, anyways, uh, we're go we'll call it a day right here. Uh, so yeah, that is it. So thank you all for watching the video, and please comment, like, and subscribe. And next video, we are going to uh, try to get into the try to get into Fontaine's fishery. Uh, you know, by getting a camera so Peach Wilkins can let us in. Simple as that, really. So shock the world and us, amiibos. Goodbye.